The skies over Ohio transformed Friday night with an explosion of color from the northern lights. And we have all the pictures to prove it thanks to uh, so many great shots from many of you at home who shared your photos of this incredible celestial phenomenon. Storm Team 2 meteorologist Cameron Saliga is asking questions about that, about how we were able to see all these amazing views. Another celestial phenomenon gracing the skies over Ohio this past weekend. We were able to see the northern lights. A rare event that had people snapping pictures and asking why they were so visible. The Miami Valley was treated to a colorful show in the sky over the weekend as the northern lights were visible in southern Ohio. Northern lights are the result of a coronal mass ejection, which are large explosions of plasma and magnetic field of the sun's corona, which interact with Earth's magnetic field. Then particles flow into the atmosphere at the poles. Now they're a result of energetic particles, we'll call them, that enter our outer atmosphere, especially through the polar regions, and they interact with our own gases and molecules out there, and eventually that transforms into light emissions, and that's what we see as the aurora. The geomagnetic storm was the first level G5 storm since 2003, the highest level storm. The storm was so strong that there was great visibility in the Miami Valley. The stronger that response, the stronger that magnetic storm, what we refer to as a geomagnetic storm, the further uh, equatorial words those um, energies can drive, if you will, and the deeper they can get into the atmosphere. And that's how people, say, in Florida were able to see uh, some aurora visibility a little bit on the far horizon. Steve Crump has never witnessed the northern lights before, but couldn't pass up the opportunity to catch a glimpse of this rare sight in Ohio. I thought it was pretty awesome, you know, um, you know, with, with my generation, you know, I'm 60 years old. Um, I've got more years behind me than I've got ahead of me and stuff like this. It, it gives it kind of a greater meaning and, and more significant um, seeing something like that. While beautiful, these storms can cause disruptions with electronics and technology. GPS problems in the northern plains. Farmers are trying to plant and they couldn't do it with their GPS systems. They had to shut them off on Friday. It was that bad. We are not going to be able to see the northern lights tonight as a geomagnetic storm is not expected to be as strong. In Dayton, meteorologist Cameron Saliga, 2 News.